this video, we will be discussing what to do under stressful situations. Stressful situations are dangerous situations. For instance, my son, I've done my best to train you so that you wouldn't have to fight. That's why I trained you so much. So much. And the, well, name some places that are very uh, stressful. One is schools because of the bullies. Hmm? Arizona? Yes, I heard Arizona is a very stressful place. Not just for the, uh, the heat, but also for the, the police. And once you start driving, the racial profiling. Racial profiling. You know what racial profiling is? No. They pull you over because you're black or you're Hispanic. Mm -hmm. I.e., they pull you over because you're not white. Thank you, son. So another stressful place is the playground. So why is that? Where? Bullies. Bullies. Many times, uh, where have I had fights? There were in schools. I stopped fighting once I started driving. But when I was on the bus, or riding a bicycle, that's one in Chicago. The best thing you can do in Chicago is get out, get out of town. It's too cold anyway. And uh, the violence in, against races, like blacks against whites, or Hispanics against whites, or blacks against Hispanics and the reverse. So that's why learning to fight is very important. So that you, you can see the, what's happening. You can be aware of it. You can be aware of it before the danger comes near you. Like, all, all three of you were with me when that boy was uh, exercising by himself, right? Running up the hill, down the hill, doing push-ups. Yeah, that's what you need to do. You need to exercise so that you're strong enough. If you're not strong enough, the bullies know it. You can sense that about other other men. So another stressful situation is when you're driving. Once you guys start driving. Thank you, sir. Thank you also, sir. So the other day, you said that you wanted to train, but then you said that you didn't want to train. What is the problem with training? I'm speaking with you. What is the problem that you don't want to train anymore? You see, violence. But I told you there's good violence and there's bad violence. When the good guy defends against the bad guy, it's good violence. You know what a junior is? In high school, if you're in the third year of high school, you're a junior. If you're a fourth year, you're a senior. If you're a... What? You're, you're what? Uh, fifth grader, that, that's the name of it. But they use freshman, sophomore, junior and senior. Freshman is first year student. So there was a freshman being bullied. Did you guys hear about it? And he was supposed to get off the bus stop, right? But the bully said, I'm going to beat you up when you get off at your bus stop. So the freshman got off at a bus stop earlier. So the bully followed him.
and hit them on the back of the head when they were got off the bus, right? Mm -hmm. Now the, the bully was a junior. So then the uh, the freshman stabbed him. And the bully died. Now freshman and junior, is there a difference in, in size usually? Yeah, there's a big difference. Because usually uh, juniors are, are bigger. They're two years older, but there's a there's there's a big difference when it comes to growth, like body size. There's a that came earlier, so that we'll finish your food. No, I'll throw it away for you. You finish your food. We came early today, earlier than usual. So are you supposed to carry a knife? Not if you're not an adult. If you're an adult, you're allowed to, but then you're not allowed to take it to an airport or to a school. You're not allowed to take knives to school or guns or, or to the airport. And then the, in Florida, the knife has to be three inches or less. Uh, three inches or less is, is small, but a box, a box cutter. Three of these. Right, 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 three of those. But a box cutter is... A box cutter is, is good enough. You see, there are three types of people. There are sheep, there are wolves, and there is a... A sheep dog. Do you want to be a sheep? I want to be a sheep. You want to be a sheep? You know what a sheep is? They're little people that are cowering and scared all the time. Then there's the wolves, which are the bullies. And then the sheep dogs that don't take kindly. The sheep dog will fight back. <coughs> the sheep don't fight back. Now, the wolf might be bigger. The wolf might be bigger, but the sheep dog will fight back. Now, it doesn't matter if you're a small sheep dog or a big sheep dog. Thank you, sir. You're generous. What time is it? This is right here. 743. Yep. No, you don't. I brought. I came earlier. Wait for him to finish eating. I'll come even earlier than this and make you guys make good videos here. So, for instance, the boy that was being chased by the at the park the other day. Oh, well, see, when you guys are playing, what am I doing? I'm looking around to see who's coming. There was one that I was sitting. I was sitting by the fence post, right by the pole, with the bicycle surrounding me, right. And the boy ran, but heavily. You know, bonk, 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 big, big steps. You know? And I said, people that do exercise don't do it that way. I mean, they jog this way, or they might even sprint, but then they walk. So I looked, and he was being followed. So I helped him, and I I got my fists up to to block the bully that was going to attack him. And finally the bully uh, backed away. So that time I was the sheepdog protecting the sheep. Uh, the bully had taken the bicycle from the, from, the, from the... The black boy had taken the black bicycle from the white boy. That's right, I'll throw your food away. But I'm glad you're done. Now, what do you want to be? Dog. Why? I'm a sheep. Alright, you can choose now. What will change your mind to be a wolf? Dude, what are you doing? Just say it. You're like I will be a sheep. You see, you're not growing up in Chicago. 
If you grew up in Chicago, there's a fight every single day over there, back when I was there. Dude, you'll learn experience. Remember when I said I was going to pretend to be a bully so that you'd take it down? There's a price to pay. If you're going to be a sheepdog, you got to work out. you got to exercise. Even if you don't work out. Like, when you get to the team, you start getting a little stronger. But then, by that time, you've got to at least work out. If you don't work out, you could still win a fight. But the chances are less. The chances are less. Like, I am no match for carpenters. I've seen how hard they work, and when I lift up half a sheet of drywall, they pick up a full sheet of drywall by themselves. They're very strong. Mm -hmm. It's 100 pounds. I think it's 100 pounds by themselves. Good night. No, see you later on. You're better than I am. Make videos in the morning with me. Goodbye, my friend. God bless you and those that surround you.